हेलो चिल्ड्रेन आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल आई एम योर मैथ्स टीचर श्वेता बजाज इन द लास्ट वीडियो वी स्टार्टेड विद द चैप्टर नोइंग आर नंबर्स एंड डिस्कस द टॉपिक्स फेस वैल्यू प्लेस वैल्यू प्रीडिसेसर एंड सक्सेसर आई होप यू अंडरस्टड एंड डिड द क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू एट गिवन इन द वीडियो सो टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू मेक द पार्ट टू ऑफ आर वीडियो एंड वी आर गोइंग टू टेक द टॉपिक Indian number system and international number system before starting i request all of you to make the notes on these topics if possible please make one thick register now let us start firstly i am going to take indian number system indian number system is also known as Hindu Arabic number system Look at the Indian place value chart shown here to read and write large numbers we use this place value chart In this place value chart the nine places ones tens hundreds thousands ten thousands lakhs 10 lakhs crores and 10 crores are grouped into four periods these periods are ones thousands lakhs and crores from the right first three places forms the ones period next two places forms the thousands period next two places forms the lakhs period and the next two places forms the crores period while reading a number all the digits in the same period are read together and the name of the period except the ones is read along with them let us read these numbers see one example here 3 is written in 10 lakhs column 4 is written in lakhs column 6 is written in 10000 column 9 is written in thousands column Eight is written in hundreds column. Seven is written in tens column, and four is written in ones column. So this whole number will be read as thirty-four lakh sixty-nine thousand eight hundred seventy-four. Okay. See one more example. Here six is written in ten crores column. This zero is written in crores column. Four is written in ten lakhs column. Nine is written in lakhs column. Five is written in ten thousand column. Seven is written in thousands column. Six is written in hundreds column. Eight is written in tens column, and two is written in ones column. So this whole number will be read as sixty crore forty nine lakh. Fifty-seven thousand six hundred eighty-two. See one more example here. Five is written in crores column. Three is written in ten lakhs column. Five is written in lakhs column. Zero is written in ten thousand column. This zero is written in thousands column. Two is written in hundreds column. Seven is written in tens column. This five is written in ones column. How will you read this number? We will read this number as five crore thirty five lakh two hundred and seventy five. Understood? Okay. So now let's move on to our next topic. That is international place value system. now in international number system we are having international place value chart many countries use the international place value chart which is shown here here the first nine places the first nine places are grouped into three periods uh, here the places are same nine places are same like uh, Ones, tens, hundred thousand, ten thousand, but here, after ten thousand, one lakh will be read as hundred thousands. Ten lakh will be read as one million. One crore will be read as 
10 millions and 10 crore will be read as 100 millions and these nine places are grouped into three periods namely ones thousands and millions we can read and write large numbers into international system of numeration as we read and write numbers in Indian system of numeration. While writing a number in international place value system, we put commas after every three digits from the right. See, from the right. Okay. Now, let us read these numbers. See the first number. Here, 5 is written in 100,000 column. 4 is written in 10,000 column. 8 is written in 1,000 column. 2 is written in 100 column. 7 is written in 10 column. And 9 is written in 1 column. So, this number will be read as 548,000 279 okay see the next example here 2 is written in millions column 3 is written in 100,000 column 0 is written in 10,000 column 2 is written in thousands column 6 is written in hundreds column 8 is written in tens column and this 0 is written in one column. So this will be read as two million three hundred two thousand six hundred and eighty. See one more example. Here three is written in ten millions column. Five is written in millions column. Six is written in hundred thousands column. 0 is written in 10,000 column. Again, 0 is written in 1,000 column. 2 is written in 100 column. 0 is written in 10 column. And this 8 is written in 1 column. So, this whole number will be read as 35,600,208, etc. I hope you understood. Now, if now what we are going to do, we are going to study the relationship between the Indian and international place value chart. If you will compare both the charts, both the nine places of the charts, what you will get, what you will get, uh, that uh, what we what you will observe, you will observe that ten crores is same as hundred million. 1 crore is same as 10 million. 10 lakh is same as million. Lakhs is same as 100,000. 10 thousands is same as 10 thousands. Thousands is same as thousands. Hundreds is same as hundreds. Tens is same as tens. And ones is same as ones. After the discussion of uh, Indian number system and international number system, there are some important notes. Please note down this uh, note number one. In Indian system, the first comma comes after three digits from the right. That is after one's period. And the next comma comes after the next two digits. That is after thousand period and then after every two digits and so on. In these notes, it has been told that how to put the commas, how to put the commas while writing the numbers in Indian, Indian system of numeration and in international system of numeration. So please note down point number two. In international system of numeration, all the periods have three place values each. Since each period has three place values, so to write a number with the help of comma or commas, we have to put a comma after every three digits from the right. Please note down.
Now, after this note, we are going to take one problem. And the problem says that, rewrite the following numbers using the Indian and the international number systems by grouping them period wise and using commas. Okay, so see the first number. In <clears throat> see the first number. The first number is twenty thousand nine hundred and seventy six. I have to write this number in both Indian and international number system, and I have to write this period wise using commas. So in order to save the time, I have already made a table. Now in this table. I directly put the numbers. See the first part. It says that 20,976. I'll start from the back side. So this uh, 6 will comes in 1's column. 7 will comes in 10's column. 9 will comes in 100's column. 0 will comes in 1000 column. And this 2 will comes in 10,000 column. Okay. So... How to write this using commas? First part. See, here, here, when I will start from the right, the period, is, uh, the period is ending after three digits, after three places. So, where I will put the comma? Here. That means my number, first number will be 20,975, 20, comma 976 sorry it is 6 20 comma 976 see see the another one here the number is 1,11,048 so I'll start from the back side this 8 will comes in 1's column 4 will comes in 10's column 0 will comes in 100's column now here the period is finished, right? When I started from the right, here the, uh, the period is finished. So here I will put the comma. Then after 0, I will take 1 in this column, another 1 in this column and this 1 in black's column. If I will observe this, here this period ends here. So I will put comma after 1. So, how will I write? I will write it as 1 comma double 1 comma 0 4 8. Now, the same numbers I have to write it in international system of numeration. I am already having a table with me. Now, in this table, I will put the values. Here, my first number is 20,976. So, I will start from the back side. I will start putting the values. 6 will comes in 1's column. 7 will comes in 10's column. 9 will comes in 100's column. The 0 will comes in 1000's column. And 2 will come in 10,000 columns. Right? So, where I will put the comma? Where? This uh, starting from the right here, the one spirit ends after three digits, right? So, my number using commas will be of the form nine, uh, 20, 976. See the second number? Start writing from the back side again. In one's column, we will write 8. In tens column, we will write 4. In hundreds column, we will write 0. Now, the periods end. So, here we will put the comma. And what are the leftover numbers? 1, 1 and 1. So, my, so my final number using commas will be 1, 1, 1, comma, 0, 4, 8. How to read this number? This number will be read as 111,048. This number will be read as 20,976. 
So after understanding how to write numbers in Indian and international system and how to put the commas, you will be able to solve these questions. I hope you like the video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel. And if you have any doubts or query, you can leave the message in comment section. Thank you.